Uh, Jay is asking, I've been using Surface ISTD tiering content marketing heavily to improve a new website search profile such that as of today, its domain authority is only three and its page authority is 90. I recall in previous semantic mastery training, previous like really previous, right, Jay? <laughs> this could be a problem. I don't see in my notes a recommendation. How do you recommend to raise the main authority? What would you suggest today? Okay, so number one, I would suggest that you don't give a shit about the main authority. Sorry about that, but that that's will be my intake on it. Number one. Number two, domain authority day, it's um it's a must metric. So you doesn't matter how hard you push it, you need to wait to Moss to update their database. And they do it sometimes every month, sometimes every two months. So it's like pushing for a public PR, you know, a page rank release. It doesn't make any sense because by the time they updated their, their data center or the day after they updated the data center or the database, whatever you want to call it, it's already down. It's already outdated. The same happened with PR, you know, PageRank, when Google will launch a, a, a PageRank update. Everyone was crazy about it, but I kept saying, okay, that's great. But the day after that, it's, it's uh, you know, it's, uh, it, it doesn't work anymore. So I wouldn't pay too much attention, Jay. Also, because again, it doesn't matter how much you push it. Uh, it won't budge until Moss updated their uh, database, right? So have that in mind. Trust flow and uh, citation flow, they're different beasts because Majestic is crawling and updating them pretty much, right? But the main authority, page authority, not at all. Also, you need to have in mind that these domain authority, page authority, they are spam metrics. If you want to jack up domain authority and page authority, what you need to do is to order our file. Don't do this, by the way. But you, you, if you, if you want to do this, you need to order a 5,000 uh, GSA blast from Fiverr. That will jack up your domain authority. Now, in terms of ranking, that will burn your, your domain to the ground, right? Yeah. So I've said it before. I jacked up domain authority and page authority with pure spam. I jacked up domain authority with spam, subdomain spam, you know, spam in subdomain. That's why I don't trust these metrics because, again, you're burning it to the ground if you want to do something like that. Do you guys want to add anything to this? Yeah, I touched on this. I think it was, it was last week or, or no, our mastermind webinar. And I, I think right. I, can talk, I can talk about it here. Where mm -hmm. right, right now, where Google is going, or where it is right now, and we predicted this a while back because we've been talking about entities for so long, just telling people, concentrate on your brand, on your entity, on your valid, on your validation, verification, and now solidification. You solidify your entity by going into your Google My Business verified listing and using all of the tools that Google has given you. Now, this is one this is one place where where I actually listen to Google. I usually I'm not going to drop the f bomb here, but I usually say f Google. Because I don't give a, I don't give a crap what they say, but on something like this, where they give you access to the inside and they bring everything to try to like hermetically seal everything and contain it, so that they can keep an eye on everything that you're doing. Well, that's the perfect place to go in, like we did with RYS Academy, to go in and start really manipulating anything and everything that you can get your hands on so that Google sees, okay, so, so this, is, this is an entity. It's verified. We know what the entity is. We know what it's about. It has products. It has services. It has hours. It has people. We, we got pictures of, of the staff of, of the building. If you, yeah, fake it till, till you make it. If you have to fake the pictures, then, then so be it. But, I mean, you have to go to that point. And the wonderful thing is, and I just saw it, uh, uh, well, I've been seeing it, but Google actually gives you metrics. When you're ranking in, in the three pack with your GMB and you get, and you get calls on a, from your GMB listing, you actually get those analytics. They give you a monthly report 
I mean, that's so that's so good of them. That's so nice of them to let you know how how well your your, your spam is working. Because I'm, I'm I I saw that 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 from from out of nowhere, you know, we had we had seven calls on something that I wasn't even expecting to rank because all we did was ver verify the business. And by the way, it's a it's a business in New York City. And so getting seven calls from just verifying a map in New York City, it's it, it's 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 not. I mean, it's, it it tells you just how powerful this little tool that, that that Google is giving you really is. So go in, build that mini site, post, and I know I can't get into the rest because that's gonna probably gonna be part of the RYS Academy update on how you can leverage all of that to, to really blast Google. I mean, just hit rank brain right between the eyes and, and, and make rank brain, make, to do whatever it is that you want it to do. So anyway, just, so, uh, just another nugget for you guys. Go and play in that Google my, my uh, verify business. Forget metrics. Forget trust flow, forget uh, citation flow, topical trust flow, domain authority, page authority. There's people who really know how, how, how to use that to their advantage, but that's because they understand the underlying algorithms and you don't want to get that deep. What I've just, what I've just given you is better than, than I think anything you could have paid for. So there you go. You got it free. There you go.